Okay, here's my setup for heating the 22 bolt action rifle to try to melt the lead out of the barrel. Here I'm heating it up with a uh, source of propane fuel. I decided to try the Valvoline synthetic gear oil since it's a little bit thicker. I thought it might have a higher boiling point. So we're heating this barrel up in gear oil to see if we can melt this slug of lead out of it. So we'll have to check it once in a while, see how hot it is. I've also got a brass rod. I might be able to stick that down in there and see what's happened. So we're waiting for it to heat up now. I had a little bit of heat from my turbo toy torch and some matte gas. Try to heat it up a little bit faster. I've got my infrared thermometer so I can see it's getting pretty hot. It's not quite up to 500 degrees yet, but it's getting close. Just about five, I'm gonna stick that rod, brass rod down in there, see if we're making any progress. I had just a little problem. The oil overflowed and caught the device on fire, but it just happened, it happened about the right time that the barrel had gotten hot and I tapped on the barrel with the brass rod and the bullets came out. So we were successful. Uh, one morning on this device, don't put quite so much oil in it because it will spill over and catch on fire. You also want to be careful squirting water on something like this because uh, that oil is super hot. Next time I try this, I'll make sure I have a CO2 fire extinguisher ready or some kind of fire extinguisher. Uh, didn't think about this happening, but uh, that's okay. We got the bullets out. Okay, we did get the fire put out. We got the lead bullets out of the barrel. I did tap on it a little bit with a brass rod and they came on out, so we were successful. Uh, the problem seemed to be that uh, after the oil did start boiling, then it did overflow and then it set the fixture on 